Good morning, it's just some delayed trucking coming at you. How's everybody doing out there? Missed you, YouTube family. Have not been on here in a while. New commitment, focusing on the YouTube channel. <clears throat> I have been and done so many awesome things that I am now to feed in where I'm gonna stay and where I'm gonna be. As you all know that I came, I, I was a freight hauler for almost five years from grocery to, from FedEx, hauling the, the cans full of packages, to grocery hauling through Fry's in Phoenix, and was in placement with the temp service for a year and a half. Because people ask, where were, like, where'd you come from? Well, what have you been doing? What are you doing? And um, like I said, started with FedEx, and got my license through them, did my two years, and it was time to grow. I love trucking and I was just ready for new adventures and, and new knowledge and new destinations. Thankful for that experience and the friends that I call family, my FedEx family that I've kept this whole time. So went through the temp service for a year and a half and took on a full-time position with Preferred Home Care hauling their compressed oxygen from Phoenix to Denver to Vegas. Definitely got my feet wet in the over the road thoroughly enjoyed it and realized that I was ready for more. Love the routes, love the people, but was ready to grow some more. And I had an amazing opportunity present itself to me here where I'm currently at, as you can see, with Plycar. Amazing people, amazing job. I, it, was, it was something I could not refuse. I was definitely passionate about it, passionate about it from the get-go, from their introduction. Looked them up, YouTube, Google, you know, everything through the internet, I, I looked them up and was thoroughly impressed with the job that they provide, the service that they provide, the equipment that they have, and then the amazing people were just to follow as I got in and get to know them. So started back in December, my training, and like you all know that I had never really been an over-the-road trucker three, four days at a time here and there. Kindergarten trucking is what I called it for myself, what I felt I was doing. So got on with Plycar and hopped on to their amazing training program. It's a four-week training program with my current trainer, and they give you all the basics to become a beginning entry-level enclosed trailer car hauler let me specify that so um unfortunately some unfortunate events presented itself i had to go home for a little bit and spend time with my dad charlie i love you and he did pass and it, it was a sense of relief because he he was just existing you all know how that is when people get sick they're just here on earth they're not living they're just existing so thankful that he's resting now. So went home for a week and a half and tended and spent as much time with my dad as I could before his passing. Now they, you know, they called me back. I had time. It all worked out because I went home and then the truck had to go in the shop. So it gave me adequate time without taking away from, from the training. So thankful I got to spend time. He's resting. The next day they called me and they said, the truck will be ready. You got to go. I was all over it. Proudly, I knew my dad would, would want me to come finish. He used to call me all the time and I'd say, hello. He'd say, where are you now? Never, what are you doing? How are you? Where are you? It's an amazing compliment when people live vicariously through our trucking life. People who are, you know, at the same place all the time, every day, every night, doing, you know, those kind of careers. So complimenting, living vicariously through me, where are you at? You know, what are you hauling? Where are you going? All the things that I always ask you guys out there. So I'm currently finishing my training program. I made it. I am so proud that I, I succeed. Believe me, I, I, I'm, I'm a go-getter and I, I died before I quit. I was going to get this job no matter what. And thankfully with my drive and my ambition and my passion for trucking and the passion that's growing for cars, believe me, I, I'm getting educated in so many ways, so proud. My trucking, my trucking experience has grown tremendously. Uh, like I said, I for myself, I went from kindergarten trucking, you know, doing my thing, whew, 
to college and now I'm graduating whoop to the top so proud so soon enough we're working our way back to uh, to the East Coast so I can pick up my own setup and I will be further sharing my experiences with you as a solo over the road lady car hauler if you don't know about ply car check them out it's an amazing company we provide an amazing service high integrity high class full of pride it's an amazing career and I am just blessed and more than thankful to be a part of this team so you'll be seeing a lot more of my, my driving experiences now that I'll be all 48 states I have a lot more to show a lot of questions and just to clarify I'm not here to discuss politics or you know dispute or I'm not trying to join a debate team I'm just here to share my experiences that I'm passionate about and in hopes that it can provide inspiration and motivation and provide confidence to people who are interested in the trucking field it's an amazing experience and and the truth of all of it for me is I love it I love being out I love you know traveling every day is something new I'm learning so much every single day so much personal growth growth in education in trucking learning the trucks the mechanics just so much growth couldn't be more proud so please look forward to my YouTube channel it's just into lady trucking I will be coming at you any questions you have but like I said don't pull me into any crap I'm not I'm not here for that I'm here to share my passion and if you love passion for trucking hop on check out my channel share your comments ask questions and you know let's just just make it one trucking family keep it positive a lot of crap out here believe me everybody has crap in their lives but that's never my first foot forward always optimistic always positive and my motto is make every day an adventure live your life whatever it is you choose to do be passionate about it and just just be happy be fulfilled life is too short not to just be happy so please look forward to my channel here I come believe me just send a lady truck in hashtag lady car hauler is coming at ya.